Well, some of us uh, don't cook our food because the power's out at the house in the winter time, <laughs> but some of us do it all the doodah day. <laughs> Raw Chef so Jane is do. here, and she's going to show us what have you got for us today. Well, today I have Apple Delight. As you know, we're coming into the fall season, and apples are going to be starting to mm -hmm. come in and be delicious and wonderful. So this is a great fall dish, and it's also a wonderful snack. Okay. Very easy to do. If you want to do this for one person, you can. If you want to do it for a crowd, you can. Mm -hmm. I've made this for breakfast when we've had guests or company. Very simple to do, and I really love it. It's one of my all-time favorites. What I've taken here are some organic gala apples, mm -hmm. and I've taken, I think I have about six of them in here. And I, I, I did chop them up in my food processor. Mm -hmm. You don't have to. You can use, you can do it by hand and make, make sure you cut it into small pieces, but you can also do it in the food processor and you pulse it. Because if you put it on on, you may get mm -hmm. applesauce. Sure. And you right. don't want right. to get applesauce. You want to have some pieces in there. So I did that with the apples. And I did put a little bit of lemon in here, not for flavor, mm -hmm. but just so they wouldn't mm -hmm. turn dark brown, just to, to keep them a little and bit. And you leave the peel on. I love that. Yeah, mm -hmm. I do. It makes it so much prettier. Mm -hmm. and, oh, I do and better use, for you. Yeah, it is. And I use uh, organic also. So I don't have to worry about harmful pesticides and sprays right. on them. So you know, I kind of like that business, too. So what I've taken done here is I've pulsed these in the food processor and again you don't have to use a food processor you can chop these small okay. there's not a problem in doing that by hand you can definitely do that uh, my food processor in my house is just a workhorse and it's always been <laughs> used to being on all the time. So, you know, but just make sure you pulse it if you're using the food processor. I'm going to take a dash of Himalayan salt. Himalayan salt contains many minerals that are trace minerals readily used by our body. And we probably, okay. most of us are deficient in trace minerals. It can also help to balance the pH of your body. So I'm just going to put a little bit of Himalayan salt in there, just a tiny, tiny bit. And I'm going to take some cinnamon. Mm -hmm. Which is cinnamon. Good for you. Oh yeah, and there's something about cinnamon in the fall. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cinnamon so and true. apples it's in so the true. fall, and it just oh, it just tastes so good. We add that to our shakes in the morning. Sure. <laughs> And I'm going to put about maybe two teaspoons in here. You can put more or less depending upon what your taste is with that. You can add a little nutmeg if you want. If there are any other spices or whatever else you want to put in there, there's no, no problem in doing that. Now I'm going to take some coconut palm sugar. Coconut palm mm. sugar has a lower glycemic index than white table sugar. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's a little bit better in that department. It's not quite as processed. This is organic from Mountain View Bulk, which I really mm -hmm. enjoy a lot. Um, I use this quite often in many things because of the fact that it does have a lower glycemic sure. index in it. It's a little bit better for us. As you see the texture, it's a little bit like a light brown, mm -hmm. sugar, brown sugar, kind of. And the flavor is very similar to okay. that, but it's not as processed. Okay, okay so we, we use a little bit of this in here. And again, this is to your taste. Okay. However much you want to... Um, just to make sure that it, you know, it's sweet enough. Because to me, I need sweet. <laughs> me too. Mm -hmm. I just need sweet. I mean, I, I really I'm like that sweet. that we have a lot in common. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, and our birthdays are not that far That's apart right. either, right? <laughs> That's some good stuff. Yeah, all right, it we've is. got about a minute left. All righty. So I'm just going to mix all of this up. Okay. And I meant to go outside and pick a couple of fresh mint leaves to put on here Ooh. as garnish, but... I forgot this morning. Here, we I just happen to have <laughs> <laughs> fresh <laughs> mint leaves. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to oh, put a little good. bit. Oh, it does, cinnamon. doesn't it? That cinnamon Yum. just gets to you, right? Mm. So there we go. And basically, this is your apple delight. Again, you can add a little nutmeg in here. You can put some raisins in it. You can put some walnuts raisins. in it, pecans in it. Whatever floats your boat and makes you happy. What'd you leave out there? Um, well. This is a little crumb topping. I kind of oh, made okay. extra. All so, right. so when I put it into the bowl here to make it look pretty, it's going to be really tasty, too. Okay. Well, it's Raw Chef Jane well, making us easy. a delicious mm -hmm. fall yeah. And if you'd like to learn from her, the information's on the screen. She teaches classes. I have a dessert class coming up. Yeah. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Jane. My pleasure. Thank you.